chat out the window, yeah? Shoot out the window. I need to go to Manchester now. Bolton area. Got the yeah. region on. Could do with putting a big massive battery on these. Really. Um, Soon we will soon we will have it into Edgerton. And they're still doing the bad works down here. Since last time. I'm into going into Edgerton now. Please get off here for the cross calls at Edgerton. There you go. This is Edgerton. Not a lot to it. it We're now approaching Thomas Edgerton. Thomas Edgerton. Didn't do much. Didn't do much. Something on. Stop is 
thought I just thought it was up there. Oh, it's out of here, look at but she doesn't, she's uh we'll see. So we'll see what happens. I'll put the video up later on today. By the time I get to Bolton by the time I get to Bolton, hopefully the other phone should be fully charged up. And then and then when I get home I'll probably dump all this video on on uh, on the uh, memory, oh, do, I'll dump it on the memory card and uh, yeah get rid of all the stuff that post down no evidence is still there next stop Bridge for the business Just come past that. Bridge. Just going up to the business park now. I don't know how many times is this business park in a fully. All the uh, trusses and everything there. The next stop is for the reservoir. You don't want to go there, it's boring. Up past St. Drew's Lane, yeah. And yeah. I'm glad that that one was not so anyway. Because it's been looking a bit suspect for the past few days. Bum fears anything. Nice. Right, it's a lot. So, this we have. 
past down here, but that uh, got pulled out. Andrew Lane. Andrew Lane. is happening in this um, place where we're going, where we're going. Where we're Our next stop is Bondi Covenue for the will be fully, fully, fully charged by the time I get into, get into interchange and then once I've done that, I'll, uh, so I'll get into, get off it. Please 
get off here for another step across the bridge. Safer, safer fell the uh, phone up and out. So, you know. I don't know. Next stop, This is, this is uh, on the way to Bolton. Because um, well, one of the major things I want to do today is get into Salford, get into Salford, and just have get some footage of how the how the skyline has changed because I know we've seen cinema on YouTube and all that but we just I just want to get get the actual you know to see what for myself what uh, what the skyline is going to be like I know 360 is going up, but one of the other things that was mentioned was that Salford City Council have basically turned around and said that one of the major aspects of what they're going to do next, and they're going to ask, ask the developers to shall we say, reinvent, reinvent their town centre again. Because this, everybody saw my video of the uh, Salford shopping centre and it was quite, it was quite a harrowing uh, video. It was to actually sit through, but we'll just have to wait and see what happens there. So I will put uh, this video up later on today, and uh, yeah, it will. It will be what well, just one of those things. I'm just waiting for the bus to move. But uh, we'll see what happens. We have a Grey Cot Street. Grey Cot Street. Someone's getting off. We're coming in towards. Uh, See what happens. So, 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 see how it goes. 
next stop. This goes to our house cafe and area. This is. Um, really, what I'd do, do with it, I'd knock the majority of it down and put high rise. Um, yeah, I'd put high rise on. We'll see what sort of um, things are happening in Bolton as well whilst we're at it. Next stop, Slater Street. And to find out uh, how some of the uh, developments are going on. We'll pass some of them when we when we get there and uh, have a walk round. We'll see. Um, so, so, one of the things that uh, I'm going to have to look at is uh, some of the redevelopments of this uh, town. What they should be really doing is following the footsteps of Manchester. That's what it takes. Because Bolton's got one of the up and coming universities around here. And it's in top five. Next stop, next. So, you know. So I get off at the, you know. Get off at the interchange and we could get a fair a fair picture of what some of the some of the uh, some of the things that are going up here. In a short time we'll get a bit of a um, taste of what they've been doing here in Bolton but to be truthful the holiday in here doesn't look like doesn't look like a place for holidays does it it's uh, a bit rubbish really so I'm just going to have a walk around <coughs> <coughs> later some sometime but it's it's damp grey of cast. I think they should put a high rise here. Put a high rise there, apartments and everything. So that so that they can basically shop use use this bit as a shop as a shopping area for residents. But I would put a I'd put a tower block there. On the right on the end of here. You know, that's what I'd do. I'm gonna go up here down by marketplace. So yeah. Please get off here for the marketplace shopping centre. <coughs> Uh, no worries. I'm good enough at the interchange. And uh, taking it from there. So that's one of the main shopping centres here, is Marketplace. There's quite a lot of empty units in there and also around the Bolton Town Centre area. Our next stop will be on Deansgate. Yeah, Deansgate. <coughs> <coughs> The 
this is Dean's game. Slaters, menswear. But they've not managed to get the upper parts of the building let. And uh, yeah. happens when we go around the corner and see how that goes <coughs> because to see if they started doing any development around here you know they've been doing quite a fair bit of uh, this is the bit where they've been filming Peaky Blinders down the bottom there that present But they've basically done nothing over on the far side there. I think what's going to basically happen is that once they've run out of space in Man in the Manchester area, in the, well, the city centre sort of thing, I think this will be the next bit. And some of the other other towns and conurbations that uh, that are going to happen. We'll just have to wait and see what happens. Just outside the job centre, the way room is this place is going to close. No, or is it? <laughs> Or oh, has it? So, so what? Set the signs have been taken down. See if it's been taken down. No, still there. It looks like the lights are off. So that would probably mean that uh, they have closed it. All this, all this area, all this area here is earmarked for demolition. Is earmarked for demolition, and uh, a new tower block will be put there. Well, we're on Blackhorse Street at the moment, and I think this will be. To this building will be to get to go because what will happen is uh, with this once it once it's uh, this is the assessment centre for, for but if you if you claim anything this is where you go for your assessments there yeah the gates are down at the moment because they're basically closed at the moment. We just have to wait and see what uh, what happens with that. We're coming into Bolton interchange now. Of which uh, we will of which we will change uh, buses. So we'll see when we get in. So I'm going to start the video for now.